college football update it's with your host, Sean Spencer A. Alex Lucifer. Oh, me, oh, my. But, yo, let's move on down the list. Uh, I see we, we got Alec in here. What is going on, man? How you doing? Do I sound good? Am I good to go? Oh, you're good yeah. to go. You're good Don't to go. Don't worry. I'll keep as brief as heck, and I'll dip out. <laughs> All I got to say is, remember the year 2014, the year Utah ran their mouth and beat us in Austin, <laughs> right? Mm-hmm. Put a, And then... What happened in the title championship? It's not happening. It's not Came happening. back and smacked them. And I don't wow. care what Alex says. I don't care what Ben says. I don't care what Sean. Oh, Sean says. I don't care what Johnny Dean says. Oregon, don't let us get hot. Oh, oh yeah. Washington, you're next. That, you're, that, that little you're finally point, agreeing with all of us. Right. <laughs> all I got to say is, everybody, watch out. I'm just going to mm. say it. We're going to, if, we beat USC, and I think that secures our spot in the Pac-12 championship, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I believe you're right about that. If we get that win Saturday, Washington, I hope, I hope you've been watching film. Because Lord knows you haven't been having ever since you guys played us. You've been lacking. And don't worry, we'll catch you guys lacking. And we're going to spank that butt in the Pac-12 championship and take that crown that you guys do not deserve ever. Ooh. And Michael Penix will throw a pick six in the Pac-12 championship. Wow. Is that I don't okay? Because that game should have gone that way. Dan Lanning made his terrible mistakes, and I don't care if it's – everybody said that Utah would smoke us. Oh, where are those people at now? Quiet. Mm, mm. Fucking quiet. I'd like to say I did not say that. For a right. no, I'm, I'm not saying you. I'm not saying you. It's, the, the D bags that Pat McAfee and all them. Oh, my said, Utah's gonna smoke them. Yeah, I fucking bet Pat McAfee. Wow, continue doing your little wow. podcast. Well, look, talk but, talk to us. Still stay in the Pac 12. Talk to us. You're, you're talking about that game. You guys play in <laughs> Washington eventually. You're gonna play USC soon. I mean, that was 52 42, a huge game. But uh, the defense, both defenses, they still gave up 40 points, man. What do you what do you think? What are you looking at this game? What did you think? It's, it's Pac-12 defense, honestly. It's just like it's <laughs> yeah, how it's yeah, yeah. It's I told everybody it's USC is like the major one that has a Swiss cheese defense. It's how Pac-12's MO Ben. I'm not sure why. I don't know what it is. I guess they're more built on an offense and they don't care about the defense. Mm-hmm. But the crazy part is there's a lot of defensive players that come out of Pac-12 and are stars in the NFL, mm-hmm. which I still don't get that logic there. Yep. But it's the schemes and the coordinators, not the players. <laughs> shit, I'm, the well, I'm glad US, um, USC made some changes about time. No knows. freaking time. It didn't help. But <laughs> the thing is, that's why I'm not, I'm not going to bash USC because mm-hmm. facing USC off a loss like that, that's asking for questions. And I think that's going to be a closer game than everybody thinks. Mm-hmm. I'm not putting US, I'm, I'm, not, I'm never going to bash USC. Because I even said before the season, USC is going to be that one game that's going to be a little close to, for comfort. Because mm-hmm. I, I it's with, with how USC is. Like, yeah, our defense is fraudulent. But when it comes down to, like, Pac-12 champ ma- matchups with Oregon and USC, I wouldn't put my finger on it being a blowout in that situation unless things get out of hand. But overall, the Pac-12, I mean... I can't really say much on like because there's there's certain teams that are trending downward mm. that had a lot of hype going into the season. Like UCLA Colorado. had a lot of hype. UCLA yeah, had a Colorado. lot of hype. Yep. They had all those transfer portal players. Yep. And then Carson Steele, my guy. And it's just like I mean I'm not I'm not playing past Carson Steele. It's just maybe it's probably coaching in that situation, mm. yeah. or it's how like everything was like maybe too soon with a a, fr- it's a lot a of changes. And, yeah, young yeah. quarterback. Yeah. So like, I'm not gonna bash US UCLA for that. It's the only team I can really bash is USC because that defense has always been like that. It never changes. It's rough. rinse, wash, repeat with that team. Yeah. yeah. Like there's some years where Oregon has a bad defense. Some years they have a good defense. Sometimes there's a year that Utah has a bad defense or a good defense. Mm-hmm. And, but USC USC always stays consistent on having a bad defense. I'm not sure if it's just recruiting and they just don't want to do it or coaching. 
All but that even top that, heavy, man. Offensive heavy. They they put all yeah. their weapons on the offense. But yeah, overall. Yeah. But look, like hey, Alex so said, like like Alex said on Saturday, I called it too early. Like, like i like the only thing that will bite my team in the ass is if we start slow, like we've done in the last couple of games, and then mm. steamroll after. Because there's when when that rematch for Washington, we can't do that again. Yep. Because mm-hmm. that's the one team. I will. There's a lot of Washington fans. I have screenshots, mm. and I am ready to unload receipts. If if Oregon <laughs> goes to that Pac-12 championship, beats Washington, I'm gonna post every receipt wow. saying Oregon's never gonna make it to them. Make it make it to the Pac-12 championship. They're never, never gonna win shit. Washington's clear on top. I bet. I've watched the last two Washington games like it was my job. Washington offense, what? Yeah, I freaking bet. Their yeah. team is rattled. Yeah. And they're they're lucky. <laughs> I, you know what, Ben? Worry about you. Worry, worry, worry no, about FSU. Man. Worry about FSU. Your resume does not. The wow. strength of schedule is not going to be working in your favor in the next couple of weeks. So. Agreed. Worry about FSU. FSU's got a cakewalk to the ACC title game. Yeah. Worry about that in the committee. But mm. overall. Like, with this team, like, I don't know, like, like we're a curse for the college football playoffs. Like, we, we go so far and get, <laughs> get, get, get so close and then it gets shot away. Yeah. It's always like that for us. I don't know why. Maybe At this it's point, just, it's winning you're in. Yeah. Hey, yeah, it's, it's all in front of you. It's all in front of you right now. But, look, I do – since we're in the Pac-12 and you talked about teams that got a lot of hype early – and now they have kind of fallen off. I need to ask you the question: Is Colorado going to get to make it to a bowl game this year? I mean, you need like what six wins? Yeah, and they six got- wins guarantees you. And then after that, they just kind of pick and choose. See, the one thing that I need two I, more wins. I, I, I've noticed about Colorado as of late, like people. I mean, obviously, obviously, I bash them, but I have my legit reasons why. Yeah. Why step on our freaking logo for no reason? Yeah, but and la- ladies and gentlemen, if you have not seen that, go back and look at his oh, rant. So good, he, he let so no mercy. <laughs> but the thing is, like with Colorado, like people, like I mean, I get it. People bash him because, like you know, how they had all the hype going in, and it was like surrounded, like all the media was surrounding them. That's over and done with. But I mean, I could see them getting a bowl game this year, but I feel like next year, I feel like they make the next step because they're. That recruiting class they're getting, I mean, obviously it's gonna be the first year of Deion Sanders, so obviously it's not gonna be like all like flash like the first year. Mm. They're making some adjustments in the recruiting field, and I would not doubt it if like maybe I would say give it like three years for like them to be, like, be at the expectations that they wanted. Like next year's gonna be a stepping stone, then probably getting like ooh, I said maybe next year's like their peak in a way because they're like their main problem is their trenches like their o-line the defense like the defensive line like their offense is like is good but yeah, yeah. i wouldn't put it past hey. them but i see him like i see him sneaking two wins that's yeah. all i really need right yeah yeah they I mean, need two wins out of arizona washington state and utah yeah i say and that's tough Arizona is okay. playing great. We saw they just beat beat up US, UCLA 27-10. Ooh, you know, now that I think about playing, it. Yeah. Now that I think about it, oh, it's like it depends on where the teams are at close to the end of the season because there's some Pac-12 teams that just give up. I mean, they'll still play, but they won't play as more aggressive. But, oh, now, now you said the opponents because I didn't really look at their schedule like that. Yeah. Yeah, I oh. – We'll see you next year, Colorado. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I think they'll steal one game and probably get picked to, uh, to be in a bowl game. But yeah, because at the end of the day, we know the bowl committee still wants it's still the draw. Who's going to bring the fans? Who's going to get the excitement? And they'll still come for Dion, even even though he has been struggling as of late. They'll be going uh, bowling in, Al- in the Alamo Bowl. Hey, hey, they still play football there. Yo, Alec, <laughs> hey, man. Hey, I appreciate this little Pac-12 update, man. I pre- and, your, and your brief remarks, my friend. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll be seeing you at New Year's Six Bowl. 
Not the Packers. <laughs> the CFB. Let's New go. Year's Six. <laughs> and it better be North Carolina. I'm ready. Quack, quack, baby. Quack, quack. quack, quack. <laughs> Y'all be safe. Alec, Saturday. Are you free Saturday? Saturday. I should let you know by Friday night. All right. Let me know. And we'll get you back on here. I got you. Y'all be safe. All right. Yeah, man. Right. Take care. Later, Alec. Later. <laughs>